This kitchen at the University of Kentucky was literally cooking with activity as students prepared different dishes from recipes. The recipe modifications were part of the Kentucky Proud Recipe Database Project, a joint venture from the Kentucky Department of Agriculture and UK. Family and Consumer Sciences Extension Agency in Kentucky submitted recipes from their personal collections that they thought might be appropriate for the project. It's a wonderful project that, in the long run, gives us, again, copyrighted recipes that are uniquely Kentucky, but also adds to the use of research in a very applicable way for the Kentucky consumer. The students working together in pairs each selected one recipe to modify. The modified recipes were judged by a panel made up mostly of family and consumer sciences extension agents. Sisters Ashley and Cole Phillips dietetic majors from Campbellsville teamed up to modify a green bean recipe. Ashley, who is a UK cheerleader and has been on UK's national champion cheerleading teams the past three years, said having her food judged made her more nervous than being judged as a cheerleader. I just told my sister before we uh, got it judged, I was like, I'd rather be in Orlando right now on the mat getting ready to compete than getting our food judged. <laughs> I was really nervous. I was not comfortable doing that at all. I'm not a cook at all, so I really didn't know how they were going to appeal to our type of food. Each month, the extension agents will select one modified recipe that features an in-season Kentucky product. A link on the Kentucky Department of Agriculture's Kentucky Proud website will feature the selected recipe. The agents will also feature the modified recipe in their local consumer education programs. We want to know that people can depend on this recipe when they pick it up to taste good and that if they pick a recipe that's Kentucky Proud and it's a part of the recipe base developed through UK and KDA, that they're going to have some mighty fine eating and some good food to be able to plate it up. Not only has the project provided an outlet for creation of new Kentucky recipes, but it's also been a great educational experience for the students. From the University of Kentucky College of Agriculture, I'm Jeff Franklin reporting.